What's going on, fam? Are you in there here? Uh, just trying to show this off. I had to film this out here real quick but before I take it out of the package. But, you know, I've seen these in Walmarts. Uh, I've been meaning to get one. Uh, and every time I would go look for them, they're gone. So either somebody's had the same idea or they're just that popular. So uh, I know they came out the holiday season. I meant to get some, and then <laughs> they was all gone. So, cause it's it's only it's all that you get to see all this. I'll show everything, but all this for twenty dollars, which is pretty cool. And I'm doing this mostly for my got this from GI yeah, Joe's. I don't have any uh, jets for my for Joe's or a tank. So this is mainly for my Joe's. So I'm not. I haven't been getting vehicles for GI Joe. You know, mo it's been mostly figures. So. It's probably one of my bigger uh, vehicles that I've had so far for Joe or Cobra. So, uh, it's kid collection, you know. You see, you've seen these in Walmart, so I'm pretty sure you've seen these. <laughs> so, uh, I'll be back with this out of package and take a look at what all comes with it. So, and right. we're back. Um, see, I got shipwreck in there. Show that. Joe's can't fit in there. Shipwreck goofing off as usual. <laughs> Sorry. Um, going to show the tank first. Because these things are bigger than... You see how big this is? I'll show a little bit. Um, now it's a plastic. I thought they were a little bit heavier. But it's not. It's a... It is kids toys. So... But you can hear that. It's kind of a hollow plastic. Not in a bad way, but you know, it's made to be durable, so it, it feels that way. So, the show off. It already comes with stickers. Uh, fortunately, this one, I'll get when I get to the plane, but this one doesn't have no sound effects. So, just trying to show it off. Uh, Put this down. I guess I saw off with that way. So. Um, I don't know if they have one for real, but I'm gonna call this uh, the Grizzly Super. <laughs> I think what was it called? The Grizzly Super Patriot Tank. Uh, from that Valor. Uh, not nah, not the that Spy Troops movie. Uh, no, that's a, a little. Silly movie, but you know, there were some ideas I liked on that movie. So now, uh, it does have a swivel, but you got to be careful and kind of force the swivel. You hear that? I hope the camera pick that up. You know the kind of ratchet effect. So it does swivel, but it's got to be careful. Kind of force it too. So. So, uh, all in all, it does work. Oh, I didn't know that. Huh. Didn't know the cannon part moves up and down. That's pretty cool. So, huh? So, I was just messing around with it, trying to see what all works. So. Okay. Uh, now, before I get to the plane, uh, I'll show all the sets, everything that it comes with. Uh, Actually, let me bring back the tank because there is a part that comes with it. This, the this gun part that comes with it, which is pretty cool. So and that goes right there. So forgot to do that. Oops. I'm trying not to. Dang, you gotta force it in there too. Right, nothing. Hey, didn't want to. That's pretty cool. So, you have your and the swivel. So, yes, sir. that goes down. So. That's pretty cool. So, before I bring the plane, because. 
uh, it comes with, I'll have to show how that goes, but it comes with two, like the bottom parts of the missiles that come with the plane. The two figures, you know, they could be fodder. I have to get my camera straight. <laughs> Sorry. You know, they could be fodder, fodder for, you know, cobras to kill or, you know, or just showing dead soldiers. This guy has weird articulation in the arms, so he's articulated to hold like a gun, but and the head moves up and down and right to left. And can, this other guy, he's probably the better of the two f figures, you know. Articulation, wise, legs, bend at the knees, bends at the elbows, swivels, standard. This was it, five, yeah, five points of articulation for this guy, so. Um, comes with this. <laughs> I know this is a kid's toy, but this thing is just pretty crappy. <laughs> I, this could be like maybe a gr background piece or something, but this little motorcycle. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry. But see, the other side is, is not finished. So it's like one sided. It is. You're only supposed to show this side, I guess. Front. Like I said, that can be a background piece. And this is what really impressed me was, uh, so you get, there's two of them that are the same. You get these weapons, these probably can go with your 6th century years, like Marvel Legends and, I don't know why, uh, some of these, you know, the cheaper figures that you get, they come with oversized weapons. I've seen those, those true heroes too, weapons come oversized, so, but this is pretty cool, especially... Uh, so like I said, there's two of these. Like it's the same weapons, it's just two of them. So you know, use those for your six-inch figures, different assault rifles, two sidearms. Uh, now this stuff, more or less, can, some of this can go. Only thing that probably can't go are these two handcuffs. And this flashlight, which is pretty cool. So th that these can go with six inch figures because they're a little bit too big. I don't know. I mean, yeah, those flashlights are, I think, too big for gels. But you got this handbag. These binoculars can go. Uh, and these two little laptops, too, can go with your gels. So these other two pieces looks like stun. I don't know what these stun batons, I think those what those are. It's probably six inch too, so. So that's what that comes with. That's pretty cool, so. Like I said, all this is $20. That's not bad, so. And here's the jet, which is kind of bigger than the. Let's see. Uh, it's pretty cool, so. Now this has the. Uh, sound effects and sound features. So, let's show that off. Locked on target. <laughs> Fire. <laughs> anyway, uh, bring back in shipwreck. So, I don't know if this is real. Uh, real. Uh, Real word, real world accurate of how he's sitting in here. Can't talk again, but see shipwreck in there. But you can get your gels in there. So, uh, this kind of does at some this looks like a Skyhawk, like a maybe an updated version of a Skyhawk. So, it's kind of how I'm looking at it. So this missile part does come off in the front. And like I said, those other missiles, you got to attach them there to make the missiles look a bit more round, rounded. So, like that. So, so all in all, this is a pretty cool, nice little pickup, I think. And for this $20, I think it's pretty cool. So, I'm going to work on that. But, uh... 
that's it. I've been guess that's all I can show right now. This is so big and my my new uh review station is not all that bigger big so anyway uh I guess I'll take some just some photos of them show size comparison with a Joe. So thanks guys for watching. Just stick around for that and until next time don't support scalpers.